challenged me <coughs> to a pancake battle. Well, French pancake showdown. Can I take a picture with you? Okay. Yes. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome to Leo Tudofika. So as you can see, we're in a different setup. We're here at the Pneumatic showroom along Mombasa Road. Thank you so much Pneumatic for hosting us. And I'm with the lovely Motua. And the, <laughs> the reason for this is that Motua challenged me to a pancake showdown. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. And that's I what's happening ready. today. Stay stay you stay ready. ready? You stay ready? My lightsaber. Uh -huh. <laughs> So, so that's what's happening today. We are making pancakes. So Mutua is a world-renowned photographer, awesome, cool dude who loves making pancakes. And what else do you like doing? Eating them. Eating them, absolutely. <laughs> absolutely. And Love eating them. <laughs> I'm a self-proclaimed pancake queen. So it's going to be exciting. Uh, we'll let you know the pancakes we are making and we'll take you through our process. Yeah, that's it. Cool, can't wait, can't wait. So, we'll start with you. What pancakes are you making? I'm making chocolate chip pancakes with bacon. Ah, chocolate chip pancakes. It's basically just a combination of things I like. Ah, awesome. Chocolate and bacon. Okay, yeah. I can get on board on that. Yeah. Personally, I'm making lemon ricotta pancakes. Which actually sounds very good. It is. It's, Even if it doesn't have butter. Yeah, it's a take for, I think it's a, it's a, like, an up-notch way of That's making it, <laughs> basic pancakes. You see, like, basic pancakes usually have just buttermilk. But now this, to kick it up a notch, I add ricotta, I use lemon, and then I'll make a, like a nice mixed berry sauce to bring it all home. I hope everybody had a saying, basic pancakes no. have buttermilk. Basic. It's no. not. <laughs> <laughs> and by the way guys, if you don't have buttermilk at home, you can make a substitute. You take one cup milk, put one tablespoon of vinegar or lemon juice, and you wait for it to cuddle. You can add the vinegar depending on how your milk is reacting, but you can make your own. Otherwise, you can buy masiwamala from the supermarkets. How do you make your buttermilk? I don't make my buttermilk, huh. but <laughs> I make a weird combo of the milk and, and vinegar for it to get in there, cuddle a bit, just be a bit. I don't I don't know the science behind Let me it. Tell you the science. I just know it makes it, it makes them either fluffy yeah, or yummy. Yeah. Let me tell you the science uh -huh. behind it because buttermilk is acidic and vinegar. Now, as you're making a sub, I, I love nodding out on these things, <laughs> and you're making no a substitute with vinegar now, which is also acidic. What the acid does to the gluten in the flour, it breaks it down side and helps to make a tender crumb. So, you see even when you're baking cakes and you put maziwamala as opposed to milk, it will be more tender because of that acidic element. It helps to break down the crumb and break down those proteins in the gluten. Okay. So, among the factors that help okay. them fluffy. Now I know. I'll be, I'll be mentioning that in parties. <laughs> <laughs> What's here in your mixture? So, in my mixture, this is just unga, mm -hmm. uh, baking powder and baking soda. Okay, cool. yeah. I'll, I'll try to get measurements from him, though he kinda eyeballed so that I share with you guys. I did not eyeball. Oh, sorry, my just, bad, my bad. Just, just anyway. throwing you under the bus. Anyway, sure. <laughs> so even me, I have the same. I have flour, all purpose flour, um, baking powder, baking soda, and salt. And salt, yes, mm. salt. And, wait, oh. and salt. So, this is my dry ingredient mixture. I've mixed it, I'm setting that aside to prepare my wet. So I have ricotta, I have my substitute buttermilk which I've made with milk and vinegar. Sugar I'll add here to my dry ingredients and then there are eggs. And the ricotta you just use it as it is? Yeah, or to, okay. yeah. Okay. normally I blend all this together okay. but I figure there's no need for me to carry a blender. Yeah, yeah she, she decided this time not to flex too hard. Yeah, I know. It, I don't want to intimidate you further. <laughs> like, huh? It's You're only, here it's with a pancake queen, and then she's the bringing out gadgets. Yeah, and she's even kept me, kept butter away from me. It's like things are just 
not been done in my favor. But it's fine, guys. It's fine. Uh, we shall make it. I'm curious. Do you have to cook the bacon first to put it in the pancake? Yes, because uh -huh. I've tried. I've tried the option. Uh -huh. These ones that I just chopped it up, uh -huh. put it in. They didn't and I was cook like, nicely. It they didn't have the crunch. Yeah. Ah. So I prefer to make it crunchy. Uh -huh. Put it in, uh -huh. and then leave some for the top. Ah. Yeah. So. Because so, I like always like cutting a piece of pancake and then also ah. biting the biting the. Mm. Bacon. Oh so I'm adding the egg mm. in the ricotta. Oh. Then I need some vanilla. Don't want to use a lot. How do you crack your eggs on the surface or using oh, the, the back of a spoon? Like a butter. <laughs> on the surface. You know, I was so surprised. <laughs> Like a real man should. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I, oh, I should start doing it with my biceps over here, like those gym guys. Well, yeah, don't there, because I'm sure you'll be able to do it. Mm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But Missy, I'm still waiting. No, I have to wait for butter. You want to wait for butter? Yeah. I don't want to mix everything together now. I want to wait till when I'm about to cook. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, okay, so you want to do that very minimal mixing thing? Oh, yes, the minimal mixing is also a, actually that's the biggest secret to fluffy pancakes. Yeah, leave alone. Okay, yes, the buttermilk mala combo does a good thing, but, but not then... mixing is the key because you don't want to work gluten, you're not making bread here. Yeah, you don't want yeah. to so, so if anything, lumps are your friend. Yeah, which yeah. was such a weird thing, but that's also one thing that I discovered. Again, I don't know whether it was by accident. I mean, I had people talk about it, but I was like, surely. Really? Uh -huh. really? So I tried, and then I was like, oh. Oh, so these people know what This is talking. good, yeah. yeah. So I do very minimal mixing, and then mm. that's it. Yeah, for sure. I can okay. vouch for that 100%. So Mutu is going to cook bacon as we're waiting for butter, so that okay. once the bacon is done, yeah. we'll be ready. <laughs> oh yeah. It looks like I was afraid of. Ah. So what's happening here is that I'm making my syrup. Motua is cooking up his bacon. The bacon is baconing. The syrup is syrupy. She's making syrup from scratch. Surely. It's, Surely. it's so easy to make syrup for sure. Surely. <laughs> I'm not, so I promise I'm not looking for matters to just fight. <laughs> it's, oh, it's hard that she'll stay away. Bacon away. Has bacon. It has really done the thing. Nice. So grating over some lemon zest in my syrup and then I'm going to run it and uh, over over a sieve so that it's smooth but you don't have to do that I'm just being extra because it's a pancake off so blueberries raspberries and strawberries water sugar lemon zest you can also use lemon juice Here's my mixed berry syrup for the pancakes. I've sieved it, but you don't have to. Yeah, so we'll set this aside as we make our pancakes. I would like the butter finally arrived, but it's good. I won't. <laughs> <laughs> now you can stop talking smack. Okay, the butter finally arrived for this young man. Yes. He's happy. He's mixed bacon fat in there. Everything dry and pack of salt. And sugar? Um, no, I usually... Yeah, so that happens. You know I'm confused because I usually don't put sugar in the pancakes. Oh, that's fine. Yeah, yeah, cook it. Yeah, be authentic to you. So, but then, huh. Huh. that's because I usually have syrup. Good syrup that I put on. So, to make more syrup, yeah. Eh, to share, but if you want, you know mine is very sweet, so it's more tart. Then, yes, it's but sweet. sweet. Yeah, it has sweetness. Okay, I'll put, I'll just put a little. Like, so, you shall not. But, 
and I'm sabotage. So I'll make it sweet. Wow. <laughs> no, 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 So the few you things that I don't lot. even measure. Eh. It overtakes the higher. And then that is oh. Uh, oh, I'm also going to need some lemon juice. So let me choose one lemon. Do I need one spoon? Yes. I need spoon. Oh, looks so good. So that is some bacon oil infused butter. Huh? You don't say. It was not intentional, but hey, it's <laughs> happening. Uh, and that's it. Uh, Sorry. Oh, I thought I thought it was me. <laughs> no, I've already had myself drenched myself. Sorry. Oh, my lemon juice. Potter cup here. And minimal mixing, I don't even beat the eggs, I just, mm -hmm. just let them get beaten by experience. <laughs> I like to mix all the wet ingredients. So this is the ricotta, lemon juice, egg, and my milk. So, make a well at the center, gradually pour as I incorporate. Same case as Mutua, I don't over mix, that's the secret. This one's let whatever forces that reside within you guide you. Guide you. <laughs> but the 200 grams is definitely a lot. I no. want whatever it, but I think that's enough. Still trying not to. You know, uh, oh, what do you call it? Mix too much. I think that's fine. Awesome. Even here, I think that's fine. Since it's a little crispy, it's just now mm. tearing. You don't need to chop this with a knife. Just, just a give people, smash. give the people some nice chunky yes. pieces. It's heaven. Yum, yeah, yeah. Now we can cook. Even you have tasted. Ah. Ah. I love using this pan because I can cook three pancakes at a go. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not saying anything. <laughs> so I put my oil. My secret again, I've come to learn, because I would stay in the steel, I put the oil as I put the pan on top of the heat so that they come to heat pamoja mm -hmm. and i don't want it to get very hot i just want to, you know there is a way the oil starts to kind of shine mm -hmm. yeah and then i start cooking okay and me my trick mm -hmm. i have none <laughs> <laughs> i just go with the vibes and inshallah it's okay i'm so anxious this first one that is i'm always afraid for it me too. Always, I. You're afraid. I thought you said. I, I'm, like right now, I am anxious. I think so I. That's 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 me. But don't worry, you'll be okay. You'll do okay. <laughs> like right now, the pan isn't too hot. I've put it too early, but it's okay. You'd rather put it too early than too late. I'm consoling myself, as you can tell. You can see the consistency of my pancake butter. It's pretty thick and lumpy. Yeah. Atta, maybe that's too early. But my gosh. Looks so good. It looks like a bowl of yumminess. Mm. So nice my ship. Ship? To no, Nachia yeah. Vera. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> uh, luckily, this is easy chapo, so it doesn't, <laughs> doesn't really matter. Plus, plus, in my defense. Mm -hmm. 
when you stack irregular pancakes, mm. I think they look more interesting than regular ones. I think so too. They I have agree. the two corners. I, I they agree. have, I they agree. have character. I agree. Character. I agree a hundred percent. She's not just a tear green for the nini. <laughs> Just in case there's someone over there thinking at your house to na jitete ama pema. Sabu jitete. Women have photos as proof and evidence yeah, because know. at least ata kuna kwa na like some depth. Eh, hey, kuna kakitu kuna hapa inaingia kuna hey. place ya syrup kuenda si at syrup inaenda to the hey, street. Exactly. But then it even forms a nice way of the syrup to drip, 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 drip. Okay. The first one will set piece of how things will go. Come and see, come and see. You see now, this is what you want to see in your pancakes. Mm -hmm. You want to see that. But now since I put mine a bit too early, I'll have to wiggle a bit before flipping because the oil wasn't as hot nicely. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. So same, same thing. It's so with the fluffy ones. Usually, like how I grew up, my mom would be like, the bubbles come in all the way through. Mm -hmm. But then with fluffy ones, I've noticed once the bubbles start in the side, yeah, exactly. It's good. The rest will cook as we continue. Yeah, and, and also this. don't let them pop completely, all yeah. of them, so okay. that it doesn't dry out. Okay. Yay! Yeah. <gasps> <gasps> yeah, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Okay. It's. This is ah, what. This is I the only... flipped mine too quickly. Okay. <laughs> if you can tell, I'm crying. And then something else. I'm not gloating if anyone sees <laughs> on the camera. And then something else. <laughs> Uh, the acid nature also the things don't brown as vile as in has this I don't know how to explain unless now you burn your pancake. That's because of the pia the acid. Oh I did not know I, that. Yeah I so this bacon for you. My pan wasn't uh, <laughs> she's Ah yeah so it was there heat not too shabby for someone who didn't heat the pan well. So this is to show you, don't be embarrassed if such a thing happens. Go with the flow. They're still going to be edible, <gasps> and that's what matters. <laughs> he was gloating oh. on camera. Oh. I didn't gloat on camera. I gloated on the side. I was like, surely. How you like that? I'm putting a little oil then swirl it since my pan is hot I'm marking with medium low to medium heat then as usual quarter cup measure to portion out my pancakes I like making three at a go as I say here we are waiting for bubbles to appear and then we'll flip this bad boy. And I usually say, if you feel like your pan has gotten too hot, don't be afraid to take it off the heat like he's doing. This is perfect. You see, he's cooling down the pan because it's gotten too hot. I thought she had seen me and she was just now pointing. So if your pan is no, no. It's not regulatable, like <laughs> yes. no, 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 but then, I, I do this sometimes. But then I sit, I switch off the heat, sit That's down, wait for the pan to cool yeah, down. Cause... Then I start because I don't want the pancakes to burn. Because yeah, this thing is so it's mm. huge, the whatever. Mm. Because you've worked so hard on the butter. See, flipping it too early. Gatwiri. Don't be like me. I flipped it a bit too early. It hasn't caramelized beautifully, but it's still cooked because it has the bubbles have popped. Mm. So imagine this color of pancakes and then you drip over that syrup that I've made. <gasps> Heaven! This is what you want someone to bring you as breakfast. Okay, with a side of sausages or bacon. Yeah. Mm. And a side of, preferably, if the person brings me the pancakes, is Hi. Me, I'm a half a cup pancake person. I don't think so. Usually for me, my recipe, wow, just my recipe. You know the way I've, I find people so pretentious when they say that. My re I'm like, yes, I know it's yours, but then you don't need to keep telling us. Anyway. <laughs> as you tell so us. You also, as you tell us. <laughs> as he tells us my recipe. <laughs> no, that's why I'm like, forget the my. Uh, for me, our recipe. This usually cooks, normally, on a good day, it will cook six pancakes. 
Oh, this so, butter? Yeah. Uh -huh. And I usually I have two, my wife has two, the kids have one one. But now, uh -huh. I need to adjust it to start cooking eight, because the kids are starting to be at a place where... Oh, they also want to... They eat two. Kwanza, my son is already eating like a teenager. Ah. Every time. Every time. I feel like we need another plate. I know, my pancakes are overflowing. Oh. And we are done. How was that? It was a long time. It was a feel long time. You tired and hungry. You feel tired and hungry? Yes. I, as I promised, I'm I going to share. Mine also. <laughs> Sour. <laughs> Sour. <laughs> As I promised. See, dust with Nini, I'm going to dust with Naraka Raka. Sour. I'm going to dust with you. I love mine. <laughs> You're looking for issues. Hi, so a little dusting of icing sugar. As I said, I'm going to share some of my syrup with you. My sauce. So this is a mixed berry sauce. Hi, so that you don't say I... You don't dump them in my mm -hmm. So that you do it the way you want. <coughs> Perfect. So now, what we're going to do, we're going to taste. Oh it's good. Mm -hmm. So now the tasting. So here are our pancakes. I'm going to lift up your pancakes first. You see them? Mine are lemon and ricotta with a mixed berry sauce. Chocolate chip with bacon. <laughs> okay, you forgot. <laughs> <laughs> Mine are chocolate chip with bacon. Awesome. Yeah. We're tasting ours then, and then we, we yeah. swap them. I don't need to go on the way that chewy. Okay, I have. Benefic. Okay. <sighs> so soft. Oh! Honestly, this is the upper notch take on classic pancakes. Love it. I've done well, I'm happy. You've I'm done happy. well, you're happy. Mm -hmm. Sour. Because I really want to taste the ricotta. Help me out to taste this bacon. I know this is gonna be amazing. Mm. This taste, mm -hmm. I love the lemon. I'm a big fan of the lemon. Mm -hmm. And they're delicate. Why yeah, they taste? yeah they, it's like biting into a cloud. Like I should be chewing with less force. Yeah. What I want, mm -hmm. the, <laughs> what the, I want because. <laughs> the ricotta <laughs> and the mixture of the substitute buttermilk really helps to make them fluffy like that. I love it. I love I also like the, honestly, as usual, anything with bacon, just the bacon is the. And the salt, the salt is like it's that really salt good. flavor is really strong and it's really doing well with this Exactly, sweet. yeah, it's working so well with my sauce. Notice I'm saying my sauce. <laughs> Notice I'm rolling my eyes. <laughs> I love it. This is really good. Thank you. The mixture of the bacon and the chocolate chips. So you, you bite somewhere, you feel chocolate, you bite another yeah, place, you get what, the saltiness of the bacon. And then the adding of the bacon grease that had the butter was also very good. Because it also infused the butter, the bacon something. flavor. Other than the bacon itself, because bacon is spread out, the grease is now yeah. permeates the whole butter of the pancake. Hmm. I didn't have the words for that, but what she said. This is really good. I, I said, I like that like, it's a case of classic pancakes made up a notch and then over the top pancakes made differently. Yeah, it is over the top. Over the top yes. Yeah, as in when you want to go a bit extra. And it can something. do with more chocolate. I just. Oh, you are a bit lighter than that. But this is really good. I'll, I'll definitely make this for my children. Me too. Once I figure out where to find ricotta, <laughs> I will let you know where to get ricotta. <laughs> and I thank you so much for. Mm. 
uh, challenging me to this and also accepting to come. I know it's a long time coming. We spoke yeah, about this way. December last year. Well, I feel like yeah. it was longer. Maybe not. Sure it was December way. last year or December of the other year. <laughs> Perhaps. <laughs> the she didn't has... attempt to perfect her recipe. <laughs> Which I'm okay with. So he tells himself. So he tells himself. But yeah, but thank you, know, you yeah. so much for joining me. This has been fun. Has been amazing. Also to thank you, thank the lovely people of Pneumatic for giving us their space to shoot this. It's a lovely space. And yeah, that's it. So yeah. thanks for having me. Yeah. Honestly, I thought this would do this like in a house setting, but yeah. I'm glad that she made it a thing. Uh -huh. Because you know, never miss out on opportunity to make things. Things. It's true. It's true. Even if it's just for fun. Yeah. <laughs> I'm joking about fun cake. <laughs> anyway. Uh, so. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. Quarry. <coughs>